But it has been every day. Yeah, we practice every, every day. <laughs> Whether you want to or not, sometimes you'll dread just going to practice, but you know you have to go and it's going to make you better. It's just that one day that you don't feel like going mm -hmm. and the fact that you do go, that's what's going to make you better. When, you get, when you're writing songs, what is your muse? What, do you, um, what helps you to, um, and what inspires you to right. create a certain type of song? Hmm. Being that we're female, most of the time we go based off of what we're feeling. Or we're what, going through, what, we're feeling. what we're going through in yeah. life, yeah. And what, what we're experiencing. Relationships, everything. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's what we do. Yeah, yeah. Individually. Me? Um, I've been playing for 10 years. Oh. I've been playing. I started playing when I was 12. I would say I've been playing for about 15 years. But I'm still learning. <laughs> Never stop learning. Because I started out on the keyboard, so and I still play classical music on the keyboard too. So, <laughs> not not all in one right. one day. Right. <laughs> I don't remember when I started. All Ooh, of Blair. Same with me. Um, maybe I was nine years old. Um, yeah, so that was like twelve. <laughs> A question for the kids, not the adult. Okay. Sure. Um, where was spirituality or can you explain to the kids the importance to have a good spiritual soul, a good spiritual background, um, how God can play an important role in your growth? Oh, yeah. Like, I don't know if everybody here believes in God or not, but we do, and I don't know how else, I don't have nothing else to say outside of speaking on God, but you, your faith in God has to be super strong. Um, you don't have to, don't give up. God is going to get you through. He already has it planned out what's going to happen for you. What's for you is going to be for you. Yep, you cannot change his will. Keep it strong. Keep your faith strong. Pray, pray, pray. Mm. Especially in this music industry. Right. <laughs> yeah. It'll dry you to Question: Because she plays drums and also sax, I want you to tell her some of the challenges as it relates to being a female drummer. China. And China. China. I'm sorry. <laughs> and and you know n overcoming that she's good for a girl mm -hmm. coming because that is one of the things that you're gonna have to deal with. Mm -hmm. And she's okay, but she's a girl. But oh, yeah. just crossing over and being like, you know, she's good because she's a mu musician. So right. maybe you can help her. It's very difficult, you know, when you're in a room and then somebody hears you play drums, they automatically look at, she's a female, she can't hit hard, mm -hmm. she's just really weak. So it's, you got to let that be your fuel to do what you got to do. I got um, a point to, to her question. It's, it's interesting that you asked about college because this is my story. I was one semester away from being an electronic technician as it relates to electronics, but my passion was music. I got called for my first tour, and the reason I'm saying it because a lot of musicians, it isn't that we don't like school, but music pushes us so hard till we, we go without our heart. So I got called for that first tour with Kelly Price, and a lot of people say, well, you should have went back and finished schooling, but music was my well, passion. Yes, and um, I would just encourage all of you just to um, study your craft. Study your craft. Um, pay attention in school. <clears throat> it might not seem like fun right now, but it pays off in the long run. Study your craft. Make sure you, you know how to read music. Um, go to school if you want to go to school or to college. Music school, like, just really take it seriously, and you can become... Whatever you want to be in the music Never industry. stop learning. Never stop learning.
workshop. Now, how has the workshop today with the kids impacted you? And did it bring any flashback and reflection when you was young? And did you have this when you were growing up? Today was a really big inspiration for us, I believe. Um, it's so good to see kids doing music. Because um, I know a lot of people try to take this music out of things and stuff, but it's good to see people bringing it back, having camps for that. And then it's good to see our girls in here, too, doing it just as hard as the men. Um, it really inspired us today. Uh, we didn't, we weren't in any camps when we were younger. We just had our dad taking us when he would go to the studio and stuff like that. That's all we had, but it's really inspiring to see this. And to be in one room with, where everybody is passionate about music, the right. same thing you're passionate about, it's just, it's just fun to see and fun to be around. Yeah, it was a very humbling experience. I'm just so grateful. Thank you so much. She played in her sandals. Drummers never play. <laughs> but I appreciate it. Oh my God. The kids ask more questions today than they ask me all week. So I think it's the good look they have. So, you know. Appreciate it.